Hello, collective. Welcome back to the Ascended Divination Princess channel. You are greatly appreciated. I am sending you all lots of love, joy, peace, and happiness. Many, many blessings to you and your families. As always, I return to source. I return to center all negative energies and intent immediately and permanently. I call in only the purest of white light and pray that you stay only in the highest of vibrational energies. Whatever the enemy has stolen from you, it is returned to you. All evil and negative plans of the enemies against you are dismantled and being dismantled as we speak. As I have said, so shall it be. Judgment is final. So we have someone that may be pissed off. Like I've been getting, <laughs> oh, I've been getting some type of energy that is just pissed off. They're mad, crying. Uh, they're trapped in some type of situation they cannot get out of. Maybe in some type of mental imprisonment or someone may be crying that they're getting locked up for doing something, trying to force something to go in their favor. Someone who have been walking around pretending like they didn't know about something, but they knew the whole time something has caught up to them and their friends. There's some type of arguing going on behind the scenes amongst a group of people. You are still being seen or heard. You're still moving forward. You're still receiving what is yours. Destiny is still playing out. You're still committed to your path. It's like someone is trying to separate you from your community. Someone's trying to separate you from your work. From your forward movement, your destiny playing out. Someone don't want you moving forward in life, moving on, okay? They want to keep something going, okay? Uh, I don't know what this is, but whatever energy someone is trying to put you in, that is the energy that they are in. Uh, I don't know what it is that they think they're going to accomplish with this. Uh, let me write this down real quick. Thank you. I don't know what it is this person thinks they're going to accomplish with this. It's like someone wants you in some type of confused mindset. They want you feeling trapped. They want you feeling bonded. They don't want you having wish fulfillment. They don't want you thriving. They don't want people partnering up with you. They don't want people seeing you in a positive light. Okay, but it's definitely going to happen. It's definitely going to happen. Um, I don't know who this bruised person is, but they are very much pissed off that things are going in your favor, okay? It's like, I've done everything to destroy you. Why are you still content in life? Someone has worked really hard to trap you so that they can get some type of fulfillment out of it. You're not trapped. You're still moving on. Uh, someone may have been under some type of illusion that they had some type of victory over you. They don't They don't have a victory over you. Everything you, <clears throat> everything you do in life is of choice. Someone has no control over their mind or their emotions. Someone is like... It's like being in an in an being in an impri <laughs> imprisonment within thyself. Like someone is in a prison in themselves. Okay, like their mind, their heart, their body, everything. They're in some type of prison. Okay, but they're the ones that put themselves in their prison. Some type of self-imposed prison. Uh, and this person would like to see a day where it's like they just take you out. You're destroyed. You're out on the streets crying. You are desperate. They want you out here desperate. Uh, they want you out here angry at the world. They want you to feel disappointed, feel like the whole world is against you, but that's not the truth, and you know it. Like, someone is really just a bitter, and that's the whole truth. Nothing but the truth, so I guess help them source. Uh, source don't want nothing to do, to, to do with that energy. Uh, but someone's biggest wish, they say, if I had one wish, it would be to destroy this person. Okay, it will be to end them. I want them crying. I want them rejected. I want them broke, busted, and disgusted. I want them, you know, isolated. I don't want them thriving in life. Okay, you got a queen of pentacles reverse still collaborating against you. Um, and her wish is to triumph over you. Hold on to something that belongs to you. Keep something that belongs to you. And she cannot. Someone has been doing something for a long time. It's stealing from another energy. And they're out here plotting against you for no reason because someone has gotten so comfortable in your energy that they feel entitled to it. Okay, so they want to take you out so they can go all out with the pretending, the acting. Okay, so now they can uh, get a Nobel, Nobel, uh, Nobel uh, Peace Prize or maybe an Oscar award because this is someone that's pretending to be in the upright, a bit of a philanthropist, but they're not. They want a prize. 
for what it is they've been doing. Someone has been pretending for so long and so well that they actually think the energy that they've been pretending to have is theirs. You got to be BS in me. There's something going on where it's that people don't want a message coming out. So they're doing some type of word magic. And the word magic is not something that's like effective. Because the messages are still coming out. It's still coming out. It's the Queen of Pentacles reverse plotting. Collaborating with a group of people. Wishing to destroy you. Sabotage you. End you. Take you out. I said something about a plot. Uh, about a, you know, like whatever like that the, the 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 tool that i saw them using was huge like they were trying to take someone out planning to take someone out they're plump they're planning uh you know you know what that means right okay they're plotting that on somebody that like this is how wicked these people are they're plotting on someone's life just so that you don't get something you don't get to your destination someone doesn't partner up with you whatever this is <laughs> when something is done I don't even think these people realize that what they've gotten themselves in because it won't there's going to be no way out there's going to be no way out there's a group of friends some of you in, some of you stand to go to jail prison some of you stand to lose everything your heart broken that someone I, I don't know what this is like, you've, you've been out here destroying what belongs to other people. How do you think that's going to play out? Like, what you take from other people, you'll lose. That's what I said. Never take what you are not willing to lose. And you all stand to lose a lot more than whoever you're coming after. You've lost a lot more than this person. And things are still being balanced out for this person. I don't get this kind of energy, you all. I'm tired. I'm tired. This is definitely one of those situations where people just throw all their common sense out the door. Okay, I'm telling you, these people are having a hard time healing, recovering, or this is what's coming up for you all. You're going to have a hard time healing, being able to move on, balance things out in your life, connect with people, move on to the next stages in your life. This is a whole group of friends that are about to be going through this together. Like you all will be on the same frequency. You know how you've been on that same frequency of coming together to destroy other people's lives? You're about to be on the same frequency of being unable to heal, move on, recover, all of that self-actualize and things like that. Well, you're already on the, self -act the lack of self-actualizing frequency but whatever other frequency you're about to be on youtube will be you all will be mirroring each other i don't know why i say you two there could be two people coming after someone for some of you it could be three for some of you it's a whole community there's a three of pentacles out here with a uh, three of cups in the reverse so it, it, it's a emotionally imbalanced community group of friends whatever you want to call it a bunch of narcissists that came together to try to control your destiny, okay? Because that's apparently what they think they were put on this earth for. You can tell them, I don't know how many times that they don't have control in uh, people's lives, but they'll still believe they do. Let me write this down because maybe I can't keep forgetting these titles. Here, uh, there you go. All right. But the, 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 the tables are about to turn. I don't know how long these people thought they want to do this. As an emperor, they're still trying to hide or control someone's investments. And he got paid to do this. These people are going to have to cut their losses and move on. Like I said, they stand to lose more than you do. Like the universe is always going to replenish you. They're always going to refill your cup. They, they will always re, re, uh, replace what it is you lost with something 10 times better. Like, that's how it's set up for you. They will always replace what it is you lost with something 10 times better. You can go from a, a, a two of cups to a four of wands. Just like that. Go from the eight of pentacles to a ten of pentacles. I'm telling you. These people won't be able to move on. The truth being out has blocked them from being able to move on. The truth is out.
they are only able to move on because of the truth. The truth will do it, won't you? A lie can a lie he, he, will spread fast, but that truth, baby, that truth he, 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 he will dismantle that lie real quick. You can spread lies far and wide, but when that one truth comes, it dismantles everything. It's a what? You mean he's actually genuine? She's actually genuine? You told me they were a facade. They were lying. Look at that. I said genuine. So they're actually in the upright? Someone of integrity? Someone of high, high honor? You told us they were manipulative. Nah, 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 nah. Nah. There could be a queen of pentacles reverse facing some type of legal issues. So this is what's coming up for you. Or I don't know if you're trying to balance something out now. Maybe whatever you're doing, that's your business. But just you all know, there's a tower coming for you all. And you won't be able to hide from it, block it, stop it, pretend like it's not there because it's not something that you're going to be able to put a mask up because it's going to be just so horrendous. Everybody is having some type of epiphany in the situation, some type of clarity in the situation, court case or something. There's truth. There's truth and clarity taking place. That's all I'm going to say about that. It certainly was always meant to come out like that. That truth, that clarity, something's being illuminated to the whole community, the group of friends. It's that, oh, we thought something belonged to you. No, it don't belong to you. You mean you're not actually this energy? No, they're not really this energy. The truth is out about how someone has been working hard. A group of friends have been working hard to sabotage a light worker. Like their one wish, their biggest wish has been to sabotage a light worker. Make sure that you don't get what it is that's yours for you, okay? You don't get anything. You're out here just, just crazy. You ever seen a mad person, a mad man or a mad woman? That's what they wanted, wanted you to be. Just out here mad, lost your mind, incompetent, mentally ill, all kinds of stuff. But the truth is out, and it has people pissed off and disappointed. They said, we all came together to destroy this person. How were we not able to destroy them? That's because the universe said that you couldn't. It's not because someone did anything to stop you or whatever or hinder you. The universe decided that you all could not. So they went ahead and exposed you all in your malicious ways. You feel entitled to what belongs to other people. You feel entitled to life. You feel entitled to everything. You don't want to have to work, okay? You're mad that you're being exposed uh, of being someone, people that are jealous. Your jealousy is being exposed, your anger, your toxic ways. So you decided to come after someone. Uh, you're angry that someone is still planning to take a different direction, even though you've tried to manipulate them, tried to cause a lot of stagnations for them and things like that. It could be a masculine in a community. That people have been manipulating. And after all the manipulations, he is still moving on. It came out again. The Four of Cups. People are disappointed. Been trying hard to stop it, touch, and destroy someone. Something started off real petty, real small, real slow. And then it just escalated to something that just does not make any sense. You got people out here paying horrendous amount of money. A stupendous amount of money. To, uh... Have you taken out? Have you blocked? Uh, let me put this down. Stupendous. A uh, monty. Okay. <sighs> you know, the, the hardest part of my YouTube life is coming up with titles for, for videos. And then when I put in the titles, someone goes into the system and changes the titles and the descriptions. Yeah, because apparently that's their that's their life goal or their life mission. That's why they incarnated this lifetime. Yeah, um, but the truth is out. These people have been doing taking uh, taking actions to sabotage you, to destroy you, defeat you. It's a whole group of friends plotting on you. Their one wish is to take you out. They don't care how they do it. They don't pay people many times to take you out to poison you. Uh, of Different types of unaliving methods have been paid for or orchestrated. And you're still here and you're going to be here. Most of you are going to be here 
way after all of these people have passed away from their karma, disease, death, uh, well, of course, um, whatever this is, car accidents, something that there's a group of people that have just set themselves up for a reckoning a reckoning and i don't know why they chose this this lifetime but i say it chose to the, 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 the reckoning excuse me it's a reckoning it don't make sense I don't get it. Tower, in po uh, poverty, five of pentacles, three of swords, eight of swords, five of swords, ten of swords. All this trying to manifest it in one person's life. They don't went from celebrating to just, yeah, I'm telling you, just being exposed. Just be seen, being seen for who they are. These are people that we used to walk around with a mask, pretending to be in the upright, pretending to be wholesome, friendly, uh, hardworking, whole time. <clears throat> whole time, these are people that steal, people that destroy other lives, but they do it in a way where you never suspect it's them. But it's them, and they're angry, pissed off, because something is not going their way. I keep hearing someone say, shut her up or shut him up. Something like that. Shut them up. Say, so why do you want someone to shut up? They're in a whole different atmosphere than you. Why are you not focused on where you are? Yeah. Mm. It's, like, it's like they're obsessed with destroying you and you're obsessed with investing in yourself and advocating for yourself and moving on and working, like speaking your truth, living your truth. As obsessed as these people are with destroying your destiny or your work, your path, you are just as equally obsessed with making it to your destination and you're going to make it to your destination. Uh, there's someone that may be pissed off because someone is advocating or maybe someone is trying to advocate for you behind the scenes now that the truth is out. With the truth being out, now someone knows what action to take or they know to take actions to balance something out. Yeah. Hopefully someone didn't make the wrong decisions when it comes to you in the past or whatever. I don't know what this is. It's that people manipulating the court system to... I don't know if it's the court system or the, the, the pu court of public opinion or something like that. Because I see the justice out here with the two of with the lovers. So this could be like the court of public opinions that they are trying to manipulate so that something can go in their favor. They want people to see you in some type of light so that if they believe you are who they told them that you are, they can keep doing something behind the scenes. But you're going to be out. The truth is out or is about to be. I feel like the truth is out about something and it has these people depressed and having to cut their losses and move on. About to be going through a lot of financial life, bunch of towers, endings, right? In work, in their investments, in their relationship. Baby, it's a whole lot. Because this is everything they were manifesting. Trying to block new beginnings. Now they can't have no new beginnings. It's like, I think there's something where people are doing word magic so that we, the practitioners, can say the wrong thing. Uh... Like, they want us to say what they want us to say. Like, things are going to go, God forbid, to fear quite in their favor. But it's not. It's not coming out that way. Like, it's not going in your favor. That whoever you've been trying to block is going to triumph. See that right there? This Queen of Cups is going to be triumphing. You're about to be either be in the public eye or you could be someone that's in the public eye. You could be someone that's very innovative, open-minded, unlimited mindset. Okay, limitless mindset. Other people around you, maybe people that, that limit themselves, but you don't limit yourself because you understand how manifestation works, how co-creating with the world, with the universe works. Yeah, again, you came out the scene 
in my last read. Queen of Cups, Empress Energy. Excuse me, let me fix this. Queen of Cups, Empress Energy. So you are someone very gifted and talented, very intuitive, very nurturing, compassionate, but it's something that is balanced. It's not something people can take advantage of. And you're a Queen of Swords as well. So it's like you know when to take on the energy. This, all these three queens are you. The Queen of uh, Swords, the Queen of Cups, and the Empress, those three women, that's you. And you are exemplifying all three energies accordingly. Now, some of you in the background of you, you could have these three women that people are trying to stop from balancing something out for you because of the truth being out. And for all those of you, these are three women that have been working, collaborating, three friends collaborating to stop you, to end you, okay? So it's that you are all three of them in one, and they could never be you. <laughs> never, darling. They could never be the star. See, you're you in balance, though. And your enemies are mad. Dang. Is that someone is angry? That whoever, there's someone, there's not even just someone. It's a group that's pissed off. I find it funny that I have the three of pentacles out here, the three of cups reversed, and three queens, the three of, uh, uh, of swords, the queen of cups, and the empress are together. So it said what they are in the reverse is what you are in the upright. The queen of pentacles is all by herself up there in the reverse. Trying to temper with justice. Trying to temper with someone's choices. Maybe trying to push someone in the court system to do something. Maybe he's even telling her, don't push me, don't push me. That like she's trying to get him to do something. Get someone in the court system to do something. Get him to make some type of horrendous decision or her to make some type of horrendous decisions. Hopefully he does the right thing because you worked hard to get to where you are. You may not want to throw that away for a, a, a imbalanced energy. That woman is crazy around you. Don't, don't throw your life away now. I think you have clarity about what's going on, how they've been trying to sabotage someone. And if you know all of that and you still go and work with them, good luck. Good luck on your karma. Baby, I don't, I, I don't know. Baby, these people are heartbroken about you. Say, oh, she's a real empress. He's a real empress. He's an emperor. She's an emperor. Like, why, why do you care about what someone else is? Because also what I'm getting is that they're trying to prove that you are not something. You're not a queen of cups. You're not an empress. Like, you're not a queen of wands. You're not a queen of pentacles. Like, why do you care what someone is and what they are not? What does that got to do with you? What does that got to do with you? This is what we always say. What does that got to do with the price of tea in China? What is your life? What you are got to do with somebody else? And the person you are coming after or trying to prove that they're not something, ain't worried about you, ain't talking about you, don't know you from Adam. Because that woman, it seems, has been in her own little world somewhere else. Sis is in her own world somewhere else. And you're just determined to prove that it's not an empress. That is not a queen of cups. But the whole time you got to manipulate this person's energy to make them seem like they're not a queen of cups or empress energy. This is like someone trying to say you don't qualify for a job or behind the scenes they're tempering with your work so that you don't seem qualified. Or they tried to say your platform is not going anywhere or your business is not going anywhere, but the whole time you're paying people to sabotage your business, your products, your platform, so people can believe that it's not going anywhere. It's not worth uh, looking at, considering she's not worth working with. He's not worth working with. Their platform is not going to grow. Their product is not going to be bought. Their business is not going to thrive. They're not good at this job position. Something like that, but they're doing something behind the scenes, paying people to temper with it, Okay. Anyways, thank you so much for watching. Stay blessed. I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye for now.